Fortnite is now giving away free gifts to certain players. And inside of today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys a step-by-step -step process on how to go ahead and unlock one of these free gifts for yourself. Inside of these gifts, you can unlock free skins, free pickaxes, free backboings, and much more. And if you're lucky enough, you may even get free V-Bucks. But in order to complete this glitch, all you want to simply do is watch all the way to the end of the video and make sure you guys don't skip any parts. Also, before we get inside of today's glitch, I would just like to let you all know that I'm currently gifting my subscribers anything they'd like from the item shop right now if you guys would like the chance to receive a free gift from me just go ahead and like this video subscribe to the channel turn on post notifications and lastly comment your epic games username in the comment section down below that way i know who to gift it to the winners will be announced on the first of the next month so make sure you guys stay tuned with my recent videos but with that being said let's waste no more time and hop straight into this glitch but now to get a free gift from Epic Games and to complete this glitch, all you want to start it off by doing is making your way into the top left corner of the Fortnite Battle Royale lobby, and you just want to go ahead and select on these three lines. Once you press on the three lines, you just want to go ahead and make your way down to the second to last option, and I just want to go to the top and press settings. But now your screen should look identical to mine, and from here, just want to go ahead and change the same few settings that I change. We just want to do this, that way Epic Games will not be able to watch us while we do this glitch. If you change the exact same settings that I change, there's no chance of you getting in any trouble whatsoever. But now that we're inside of this settings, at the top of your screen, you should notice that there's a video tab, a game tab, game UI, touch and motion, mouse and keyboard, controller options, audio, keyboard controls, wireless controller, and lastly, account and privacy. But now once you have found all these settings tabs, you just want to go ahead and make your way to the top of your screen and just go ahead and select on the second one. It should be called game and from here once you are inside of this tab, just go ahead and make your way down to the first option here which is going to be language and region. Once you make your way to this language and region option, the first setting underneath it should be matchmaking region. Once you find this from here, you just want to look on the far right side of your screen and from here once you look on the far right side of your screen, you should find these lists of all these different regions. Right next to each region on the right side, there will be a number in parentheses and you just want to go ahead and find whatever number is the highest for you. So for me personally, looking on this right side here, as you guys can see, my highest number is 289 MS, which is Oceana. So once you find your highest number, you just want to go ahead and press through these arrows on the matchmaking region setting until you get to the region that's farthest away from you. Yours might be different from mine, it just depends on where you live, but from here once you have changed that setting, you just want to go ahead and scroll all the way down to the bottom of this page, and once you're at the bottom, you should find that there's all these replay settings. There's 5 in total, and you just want to go ahead and turn all these 5 replay settings off. Once you turn all these replay settings off, and you change the matchmaking region to the one that's farthest away from you, just go ahead and press apply. From here, once you've pressed apply, just go ahead and press back, and now that you're back inside of the Fortnite Battle Royale lobby, we're ready to start the next step of this glitch. But now that we are back inside of the Fortnite lobby to get started with the next few steps of this glitch, all you want to simply do is make your way into the right corner here and press change game mode. Once you press on change game mode at the top of your screen, you'll notice that there's a discover tab, a browse tab, my library, create, and lastly, island code. To start this next step off, simply go ahead and make your way into the second tab here, so it's going to be the browse tab. And now that you are inside of the browse tab, go underneath the second setting that says all categories. From here, just go ahead and make your way into the very bottom right corner, and here you should find zone wars. Once you find this zone wars option, just go ahead and select on it, and now all of these different zone war maps will pop up on your screen. All you want to simply do is start at the very top row and just count three over, so it's going to be go goaded. Once you find this go goaded map that I'm currently highlighting, just go ahead and press on it. Now that you have pressed on this go goaded map, you just want to go ahead and change your game from public to private. Once your game is set to private, from here you just want to simply ready up. And now that we have readied up, we just want to go ahead and wait a few moments for this game to launch. It shouldn't take too long, so I'll be back once this does happen. Now that this secret creative map has finally launched, all you want to simply do is look in the bottom left corner, and as you guys can see, it takes around 30 seconds for this map to auto start. However, if you want to speed things up, you can always open up your menu, go to the second tab down, and simply press start game. Once you've either waited for this auto start time to run down or you started the game manually, once you enter, you just want to go ahead and enter one of these four teams. It doesn't matter what team you enter, but you just want to go ahead and enter any one. As you guys can see, once you select a team, you'll get spawned into one of these boxes. Once you are inside of one of these boxes, you just want to go ahead and make your way out this main entrance here. And I just want to make your way into the very middle of this map where the golden mushroom is. Now once you get over to this mushroom facing directly at it, you just want to go ahead and get your builds out and you just want to build three ramps up. So one, two, three. Now once you have built these three ramps up, just go ahead and place a floor at the end of this. Now complete, we turn around and stand at the end of this floor and place one more ramp. 
once you build this ramp, just go ahead and continue to build three more ramps up. So one, two, three. And now from here, just go ahead and place one more floor at the end of this last ramp. Once you're at the end of this last ramp, all you want to simply do is open up your inventory and just go ahead and drop all the weapons that you have in your inventory. Once you have dropped all of these items, all you want to simply do from here, you just want to look down and simply jump. Once you jump, you'll notice you get eliminated to the fall damage that we just took. And once this does happen, you know that you've done everything correctly so far in this glitch. As you guys can see, you'll get respawn once again, and from here, all you want to simply do is open up your menu, go to the last tab down, and simply press return to lobby. But now that we are back inside of the Fortnite Battle Royale lobby, we are so close to being completed with this glitch. There's only a few more steps that we're going to have to do, and a little bit of this is going to take place back in the settings tab. So once again, just press the three lines in the top left corner, press the second to the last tab down, and now just press settings. From here, just look at the top of your screen and you just want to make your way down to the very last tab, which is going to be the account and privacy one. But once you're inside of this account and privacy tab, you just want to look at this first section here, which is going to be the account one. Once you find this account section, look at the first setting underneath it, which is going to be epic account ID. Once you find this epic account ID setting, if you look on the far right here, you'll find this long line of a bunch of numbers and letters, and that is actually our epic account ID. We're going to want to type this in the text chat back in the Fortnite Battle Royale lobby, but to make it a lot easier for us, you just want to go on the right side of this setting and you just want to go ahead and press copy to clipboard. Once you copy your epic account ID to your clipboard, you just want to go ahead and press back from here. And I just want to make your way into the bottom left corner once you're back inside the Fortnite Battle Royale lobby and open up this text chat. Once you open up this text chat, you just want to go ahead and type in the exact same secret code that I type in to get this glitch to work. To start this secret code off, just go ahead and paste your epic account ID. And from here, you just want to go ahead and put a period and now just type gift. Now just put another period and type epic games and i just want to go ahead and in parentheses you just want to go ahead and type true now i just want to go ahead and put a dash and i just want to simply type in your fortnite display name so for me it's frosty on youtube so i'm just going to go ahead and type that in and now once you have typed in your display name from here all you want to simply do is go ahead and press send if you have done everything correctly so far it should say you must be in a channel to send a message once it does say that you have finally completed this glitch from here to claim your gift from Epic Games, you just want to go ahead and wait about two days. It'll change for every person, but that seemed to be the max of how many days it took. Once you receive this gift, you just want to go ahead and press open, and then from there you should get gifted a skin, back bling, V-Bucks, or even a pickaxe. Don't forget that I'm going to be gifting my subscribers anything they'd like from the item shop, and all you have to do to enter is like this video, subscribe to the channel, turn on post notifications, and lastly, comment your Epic Games username in the comment section down below, that way I know who to gift it to. But thank you all so much for watching today's video, it is truly appreciated, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace out.